Thank you, Mr. Chair, members of the board, uh, Mr. Town Manager. My name is Pete Lachapelle. I work with Waste Management. Uh, I appreciate your time this evening. I'm here to talk about what's going to be on your agenda a little bit later, the recent uh, trash and recycling hauling services bid that went out mm -hmm. early December of yep. last year. Yep. Unfortunately, Waste Management uh, did not bid. How the bid was written precluded us from entering a bid. However, two companies did supply bids, Triano and Commonwealth Waste Transportation, or CWT. Triano's bid to, tra uh, to transport the waste to either e to Eco Main in Portland and ironically to Rochester Turnkey Landfill was 350 per haul or 16.75 per ton, and that's based on an average payloads of 20.89 tons over the last 12 months. And CWT came in at 255 per haul or 12.20 per ton either to Rochester or North Andover, Mass. CWT was the little bit on the transportation part. However, the real concern I have is on the tipping end or the disposal piece of it. I realize the town, while well, will be at the end of July or end of June, no longer a member of the Southeast Regional District. However, as part of Waste Management's bid response last year to the district, Waste Management would honor pricing regardless if the town stayed in the district or not. Our pricing on that bid was $60.25 per ton. Eco Main was $55.85 per ton. Now on the surface, yeah, they were $4.40 less per ton. However, if, if you take into part, our, if you consider our original bid, we also proposed that waste management would honor that new pricing effective, effective January 1st of this year. In essence, saving the town $50,000 just over. Now, the combined disposal, tipping, and transportation bid from waste management and CWT is $72.45 versus Triano and Eco Main at $72.60, 15 cent different. And when you add the additional savings associated with the early reduction in tipping fees, that would save the town over $60,000 when you combine the tipping and the transportation differential. Now, it has come. I have come to learn that the town went back to Eco Maine to see what they could do for a better disposal number. The argument I heard was since waste management offered an alternative bid, that the town felt it was only fair for Eco Maine. I, I personally, I don't think that really holds merit. The bid was the bid, right? I mean, when the bid goes out, that's your bid price. Every vendor submitting a price had the opportunity to do so, and waste management came to the table and was able to offer something. Two other important points I want to make uh, point out is this bid was a bid for the Southeast Regional District, not the town of Hampton. So I guess I'm a little confused on how the town can go back to Eco Maine and ask for a better disposal pricing when your bid in December was for hauling only. So it's a little confused on that. And the other point, is, and again, I just looked at it briefly, your own uh, 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 purchasing policy and procedures, it looked like you may have uh, broken those as well. But point of order, Mr. Chairman, is, is this a business appointment or is this public No, comment? and where your time is coming yep, to It is, and I, you know, I appreciate uh, your time. I sit in your shoes on the city council in Rochester, New Hampshire, so I know this very well. So I'm Thank here, you. I appreciate your time, and hope you consider all the facts before you make Thank a decision you. on this important contract. Thank you.